It's nine in the morning. Yes, I slept a little bit. Oof. But the sun is shining. Uh, kind of into the car. Yeah. We have all the sun shades just trying to block it, but at least the roof is open. So, well, semi open. But yeah, I think I have to get up and uh, start preparing now because uh, it, today is going to be also a pretty hard one. We have two legs that uh, that are over 200 kilometers, so it means I have to charge to 95% on each of them and take it easy. Yeah. So, oh, okay. And the problem today is that I will have headwind most of the time. But it was pretty good again sleeping in here. Yes, except that sun is shining. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. We are now at Noor's Shoes Botten. Nice weather today, still. But it, over here it's not too hot. But just perfect to sit here in the sun, enjoy the nice weather. And then breakfast is just, uh, well it's a veggie burger, but it's just a burger. Circle K, I tried to support Circle K, and it's very convenient. So uh, yeah, let's eat up. Mm. We are now at Bistavara, juicing up. So, it's time for lunch. I'm uh, boiling water here, yes, uh, via the 12 volt. So, I have the choice between, look, knoll, pasta snack. This is kase sane sauce. Or, ka well, it's the same one. Okay, whatever. I'll take one of these. Okay, this is it. We are at 93% and the charging speed has dropped to about 6 kilowatts. Uh, so I was getting 16 kilowatts until right about now. And now it's time to leave. 
So, see here, the reason why we charge to over 90% is that we have to drive 229 kilometers to Alta. There is, well, there, there are two 50 kilowatt fast chargers there, but one is broken. <laughs> so we just have to go for the, the other one, uh, even if you have to wait a little bit. But, so 229, GOM says 218, but we can make it. Uh, I calculated, we can make it. We just have to drive a little bit slower. Oh, so here we go. Finally, the first challenge run here to Alta. We are finally in Alta. There is just one problem, which is that we have two Fortum chargers here. Uh, one is kaput. The other one, I just tried it and it, it doesn't work. The other one is taken by Kona right now. And if you look at the charger screen here, Kona came uh, 24 minutes ago. So Kona should be good to go soon. So we just have to wait for the owner to come back uh, soon, but yeah, this one is not working, so it's actually pointless for me to charge on AC even. It goes so slow, so I'm not gonna bother. So I'll just have to wait here. Woo! Okay, after about 15, uh, 20 minutes, I got the charger. I'm getting 49 kilowatts. Yes, good shit. Um, and now I'm going to uh, deliver uh, a shuttle adapter. Well, here's all my luggage, by the way. So I brought the channel adapter, it's in here. I've been using it on uh, Model S and X for the longest time, but then for Model 3, I don't need it anymore. So just happened to sell it to some guy living here up in the north. Uh, well, he doesn't live here, but I will deliver it at the hotel. <laughs> Whew. Uh, we went to uh, the hotel, I delivered the channel adapter, and then I went for Pepe's Pizza, and I thought, I want some fast food. This thing here took 20 minutes and yeah, we are already at 89% and you know what we're getting? We're getting 25 kilowatt. That's good stuff, man. It's a 16 kilowatt. I think the battery is nice and warm, but uh, I need to eat a little bit. So I figured that I'm going to go for a big, big ass pizza. Let me show you. Oh yeah. Um, because I will eat some of it now and then this will also be my dinner at Honningswall. Uh, so, okay, let's dig in.
We are finally here, Homninsburg. But you know, this is not the end point. No, the end point is North Cape. Uh, it's 30 kilometers from here. But we don't have enough juice. So I'm charging now. This is the hotel, the view. I was here last year with MC Hammer. Back then they didn't have a charging station. Uh, I just used a blue plug. But now we have charging station. I'm getting 6.6 .6 kilowatt after charging losses. The car has 7.4 kilowatt onboard charger. So I guess we have to stay here for about an hour. But you know what? I still have pizza. Yeah. So I still have lots of pizza. This is what I plan anyway, that I would just eat pizza here while I'm charging the car. Yeah. <laughs> so, and then we go for North Cape. So um, it's actually going to be close to midnight by the time we get to North Cape. Yeah. Oh yeah, we've been here over an hour. So we have 93 kilometers now. That's about 38% when I checked. So, Time now is 11, so we will be at North Cape before midnight, 32 kilometers. So let's crank up the music and start driving. We are finally here. This is the North Cape. I'm not supposed to be here. So um, that's the globe over there. That's where everyone takes photo of. But yes, I would just, just, just say that. Yeah, we're not supposed to be here. I just took a, um, a little photo there. Yes, and here, okay. I need to take for, for uh, yeah, it's not a good shot anyway, like this. See, ish, by the North Cape, ah, oh, checkpoint reached. <laughs> this is North Point, most point in Norway. Yeah, with the MG. <laughs> you know the best part? I had to drive home tomorrow. <laughs> more hammering, 2,000 more kilometers back home. Oh, I've been there before with Millennium Falcon and MC Hammer. So, you know what? I should make this a tradition to drive back here every summer. Not winter, summer. We just have to figure out what car next year. Yeah. See, that's the globe. And then here we just have flat land. And then there's, that's the... I guess they have some museum and stuff over there. You can pay for extra access. And there's also a restaurant and 4G connection is really good. I think we have some antennas there. So I'm, I'm live streaming right now. Let's see, we have 565 people watching and we have 4G plus. Wait, you know what? Maybe I should test speed test. Uh, I have 4G on this, this one here. Let's see. If I go speed test. Oh, there's a donation. <laughs> Let's check here. Let's check speed test. Go. What do we get? What do we get? 4G plus here. 130, 140 kilo, megabit per second at North Cape. Wow. What about upload speed? Wow. Whoa. <laughs> Look at that speed. 50, 58 and 60 megabit per second upload. <laughs> I bet lots of people are using internet around here. So they want to have fast. Look at that. 155. <laughs> oh, okay. But well, look here. This is just amazing, man. We have this, this cliff. And you see, this is where hot sea meets cold sea. And then we get, we get all this fog. So down there is the ocean somewhere. And then this plateau is around 
I think it was around 300 to 400 meters tall. Yeah, so it's amazing because it's usually very, very windy here, but today it's so calm that I can put this up there. <laughs> now I'm going to show from a different angle. You see here, it's almost like we are above the clouds on an airplane. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Uh, and you know, it's, it's like this all over the place around here. If you guys watched my video from last year with Fortum, when we drove around Finnmark, it's like a it's like a plateau like this all over the place, and then it dips three usually 300, 400 meters down to the ocean, and then on top it's just flat. I really don't know why it's like this. There is some geological explanation why it is like this, and you see. Over here, it's really hostile environment, so no trees are growing. We have a little bit of grass, that's it, and then just rocks. So, really amazing landscape. Now back at the hotel, the view, yes. So what's good about this hotel is that um, charging is included in the price and also for breakfast. Uh, it's kind of pricey, this hotel. It's just one single room, I'll show you soon. It's 1,100 nook, uh, about 110 euros. Uh, and they have one charging station, but it's 7.4 kilowatts. So you know what? We will just charge up now. Uh, and then in the morning we will have full battery. So let me just get my equipment and then we go to the room. So this is a hotel, not too fancy or not, but nice location on top of the hill here. And the chargers, in case you come here, the charging station is behind there. Just one though. Um, there might be, I, I think I saw a 16 amp, uh, 16 amp blue plug. Uh, that's 3.7 kilowatt. Might be operational. Maybe they have something in the garage there also. You can always ask the stuff, but here, yeah, look at that. Wow, it's so calm now. Honigsvog. Yeah, about 1 a.m. Mandatory room inspection. This is the entrance. Here we have restroom. Yeah. This hotel is fairly new. So everything just looks fresh and new. It smells new also. And it's just a single room. So it's just a single bed. <laughs> that works for me. Oh, and then here we have the view. Actually, not too bad view, but I guess if you pay extra, you get the nice view, but this works for me also. So that's gonna be it then. Yes, time to get some proper rest now. I don't wanna stress tomorrow. I will just wake up 9, 9.30, grab some breakfast, maybe come here back here and pass out. I have to check out at noon. So just have to get proper sleep before I go on the same way back again. So that's gonna be it then.